Hi and welcome to another Schoolbox tutorial. Today we're going to be covering the use of text boxes uh, with customized content on different dashboards for your different groups within Schoolbox. As of version 12.5 you can see there's a dashboard configuration system and this allows you to uh, drag and drop around the various components on a dashboard. One of the newer components is the text box component which can be dragged in place for your different groups. What I'm going to do now is show you how to control the content within that text box. So what we're going to need to be uh, what we're going to need to do is create a folder which is going to house the text box that we're going to want to display on the dashboard and we're going to need permissions uh, on that folder for the particular group so in this case I have write permissions as an administrator so then we're going to want to view that home page and once here we want to add a text box to that page and click modify now what we're going to do is put the content that we want to insert into the text box and you can see here I've created some HTML text and uh, some styling so that I can obviously use this space to put uh, any kind of content that I want to display. So once we've added our content and saved that then we're going to navigate back to the text box component that we added to our dashboard and we're simply going to point that dashboard component to the text box that I previously created. I'm also going to hide the heading in this instance and click update. Now simply navigate back to the dashboard and we can see the custom content has been added to this interface for this user. So I hope that's been helpful. We're looking forward to seeing the various ways that everyone uses this new feature. And thanks again for stopping by. See you next time.